Hello, my name is Yvonne Smith and I am the Traveling Vegetarian. Taking a couple trips this summer. I have learned this summer how to, how to travel on almost no money, which has been so great. And I just came back from AR a couple weeks ago, which is the Animal Rights Conference in Washington, D.C. I wasn't even sure if I was gonna be able to go because I couldn't justify flying, but at the last minute, a ride dropped in my lap and I was able to go, which was great. I ended up driving up with uh, my friend Stephanie Ellie, who is another vegan singer-songwriter from Northern California who lives in Nashville so we had a great time it was about an 11 hour drive and we had an amazing time at, at the conference it was her first time so it was fun to see her experience it for the first time and of course I got to hang out with a bunch of old friends and also meet a bunch of new ones I, I met some really great musicians this year and just other people doing just awesome amazing things it is so inspiring when you go and you see the passion that people have and the things that they are willing to do for that passion it's just it is awe-inspiring and you come back and, and like for me I'm just so fired up and and ready to, to get stuff done and it's it's really it's really awesome if you've never been to a conference I know I say this every time I come back but if you've never been either go to vegetarian Summerfest or AR or any of these amazing conferences anything that you're passionate about if you go to one of these conferences it's just being around other people I mean they set an attendance record at AR this year there were a thousand people there just being around that many people that you know kind of feel the same way way you do about it about a, any kind of cause is just it's awesome so highly recommend that um, let's see uh, I got to sing at AR which is so cool I sang my song love all at the morning plenary right after Dennis Kucinich spoke huge honor so I was joking that he opened up for me which you know of course that's not really true but it's fun to say and uh, and then I got to sing sing again that evening with Stephanie who sang her she sang two songs one of hers um, was called take me home and she wrote it just for just for uh, that purpose and she's actually going to be donating that song for any kind of you know animal organization that wants to use it for their website or any kind of promotional purposes but um, it's great and so I worked up some harmonies with her and, and got to sing that with her and we're actually playing a gig together here in town um, on August 17th I'm going to be opening up for her, and uh, it's at the Red Rooster, and so I'll keep you posted about that. Uh, let's see, what else? Um, oh, and my friend Jerry Cook played Dulcimer with me, which was so cool. It was just beautiful. He's he's amazing. I see him at every festival and or every uh, every conference and everything, and it's just it's great. It was so nice, such an honor to be able to play with him. And there are pictures of that on on Facebook, and and so I'm really glad that that moment is preserved. Oh, um, video actually as well. I think there's a few videos flying around. So. Good times. I'm really, really excited. I was able to share some music with people and met some other musicians. Uh, Gene Blaylock from a band called The Faded. He's doing a lot of really important work, and that's very cool. And then I met this woman from Brisbane named Lee Chantel, who just happens to know a bunch of people that I know in Brisbane. It's great. I mean, such a small world, but you know, it's it's funny to ask somebody from another country if they know somebody that you know, and it happens to be one of their best friends. So that's just that's awesome. So. And speaking of music, I actually have a new song. It's called Telling My New Story, and you can find that on my MySpace page. It's myspace.com slash Yvonne Smith Music, or you can listen to it on biffbangs.com. Biff is my producer and songwriting partner, and um, it's B-I-F-F, -F, F is in Frank, B-A-N-G-S dot com. You can listen to all my songs and purchase them there. And I also have CDs now, which I'm very excited about. I've been selling these around for five bucks. Um, there's three songs on it, Love All, or it's, well, it's called Love All, but the songs are Let Go, Love All, and Be Here Now. And uh, so, yeah, there's that. And then I also have these very cool shirts, which have the song titles of the CD on them. Let go, love, I'll be here now. Isn't that a pretty design? I'm very excited about these. I've got different colors and different sizes. I've got to find out how to sell these online. So if anyone has any suggestions, I am all ears. Um, I have a WordPress website. I know there's got to be a fairly easy way to sell these because um, I've got people from all over asking about them, but I don't really know how to do that. So if anybody would love to help me with that. I would be very appreciative. So, what else? Um, well, I did go to Atlanta for that Oprah My Own Show audition and did not get picked for the reality show, but that is completely fine with me. I actually really just wanted a chance to get my idea out there, and it was a really interesting experience. So it was crazy to be with that many thousands of people, um, all wanting the same thing. But it was it was cool. I mean, I met so many fun fun people with really good attitudes, and there were so many great ideas. So it was it was good. It was I have no regrets about going. Uh, I saw the Paul McCartney show a couple weeks ago. Oh, I guess that was last week here, the 26th. That was, ugh.
was so good. If you get a chance to see Paul McCartney on this tour, go, because it was mind-blowingly good. What a great, great experience. I was just grinning the whole time, and it was, it was incredible. So great musicians, great vocals. The sound was actually good in the Bridgestone Arena. I, I, I was really surprised at how good the sound was. And uh, so, yeah, like I said, if you get a chance to go, go. It was really, really great. Um, let's see. I got a new button at AR. It says, I love vegan guys. <laughs> it's always fun. Um, let's see. I'm trying to get to Northern California and Southern California. I'm tempted to just get in my car and go at this point, but it's kind of a five-day drive if you take your time, and I would like to take my time, so I'm not sure. I, I don't know. I'd love to fly out, too, but it looks like I might actually have a gig coming out there um, very soon, so if that's the case, I'll just hop on a plane and go and sell a bunch of merch and, and pay for my trip, so that'll be really exciting. I'm dying to get out there. It's been a year. It's been a year since I went to California. That's crazy. I usually go once, twice, maybe even three times a year, and I just haven't been, and it's just, it's killing me. My stepsister is a tattoo artist out there. Her name's Shannon Archuleta, A-R-C-H-U-L-E-T-A. -E go to her website, shannonarchuleta.com. She's awesome. But anyway, um, she does all, all my tattoos, and this, this latest one that I got last year is, I think, I've, I know I've showed it to you before, and I'm not even sure if you can see it on the camera, but it's a V for vegan, and it's white ink, so you can just barely see it, but it's so cool. And I really want more on this wrist that are like that, and uh, so that's that's next. Got all kinds of ideas. I'm probably going to get a sea turtle at some point too on my back. I'm I'm wearing a sea turtle necklace actually right now. I feel like after the oil spill, I want to keep them as close to my heart as I can. So, uh, let's visualize a clean gulf, shall we? Just take a moment. Yes. Anyway. My name is Yvonne Smith. I am the Traveling Vegetarian. I thank you so much for keeping up with me and for listening and for uh, checking out my music and supporting everything I do. Couldn't do this without you. So thanks again. I'll talk to you soon.